what it meant to be gay in America changed forever because of Angels in America. In the early and mid 90s, the play had an agitprop component apart from everything else that was going on in it. And there are a million things going on in it. But one powerful piece of it was this kind of almost Clifford Odets like thing of the audience going, yes, that's what, I, that's what is, that's what we need to hear finally. That is the truth as we see it and as it has not been said before. And yes. Years later, you know, I've, I've met so many people who would just say to me, that play changed my life. You don't understand what happened. I brought my parents, I came out. It changed how I thought about theater. It changed me as a writer. It changed me all of this. Now it wasn't just the play, of course. The play by itself can't do that. But when a play hits the moment of its time and actually strikes the nerve that Angel strikes, you can feel that play contributing to changing the temperature, changing the dialogue in the country as a whole. There were this, these moments of, of such raw intensity. There was this sense of um, that we'd been through this extraordinary uh, event together, and it was really moving. That was part of the joy of performing it. At the end of it, we were all applauding each other, you know. There was this kind of, my God, we've made it through this journey together, this audience. It was um, immensely powerful um, to be doing that play um, at that time. Um, I'm, I'm very curious to see what it's going to be like now. Will the ideas resonate? Sure. Will the emotion resonate? Sure. It's a great play. But will that synchronicity of history and timing and play and we can make a difference? I don't know. I don't know. When I teach Angels of America to undergraduates, those kids respond to the play as if it was written today. There's, and, and they also respond to it as if it's theirs, if it's somehow their voice speaking to their children. Now, Tony's older than I am. You know, and yet somehow that play, you know, written over 20 years ago and still speaks to young people as immediately as if it was their story or their lives. It's like Our Town or any great classic play. When you re-encounter it in your life, at different points in your life, it has different meaning. Um, and that's the, that's, the, that's the great thing about, um, you know, a masterpiece. <laughs>